Hello friends. Thank you for joining me in part two of this video discussion about God. In my last video I talked about truth, reduction, and design versus complexity. But I did not express my stance, which seems to have been a bit confusing. In this video I will better clarify my stance. Truths are facts, irrespective of perception. For example, if I were holding a cube object, and then drop the cube object into a bag, the following statements would be true. The bag contains a cube object. The cube object is now in the bag. My intent was to have the cube object in the bag. These truths are matters of fact, and facts comprise reality. Through science, we have learned and will learn a great deal about reality. Whereas, once upon a time, we needed to lean on mysticism and mythos as tools to better understand and organize our lives, we can now use science to reliably test and predict ideas to provide evidence for the facts we observe. I know that the title could have been confusing. I state that God exists, and then I also say I'm the atheist in the, in the same sentence. I do get how that could be confusing. Acknowledging the truths and the reality of life and the answering the God question must indicate that God in fact exists. But before you consider the case closed, let me explain. God as an idea exists as an idea. So in that way, God exists. If it did not, we would be unable to discuss the notion. God as a threat, and in many other ways, exists. This is really an indisputable fact. The problem is with claiming that God exists within reality as more than an idea. To make such a claim, evidence is required. And, as egregious as the claim is, there must be sufficient evidence. Evidence of God as an idea is abundant. Evidence of God in reality is merely supposed, assumed, imposed. All right, well, hopefully I've clarified my position and things I've said make sense and you can get a good understanding of what I mean and uh, what I'm talking about here. Uh, if you liked it, go ahead, please subscribe, like, do what you gotta do. In my next video, I'll be looking at some uh, YouTube personalities and looking at their arguments and discussing that as well. So stay tuned for that one. And you guys have a good day.